how to represent all entities relationship what do we mean by a relationship and how many types of relationships are there in database management system hello everyone i am sukanya from go edu hub technologies and today we are going to look about all the question answer related to entity relationship so to begin with what is a relationship a relationship describes relation between entities relationship is represented using diamond or rhombus you can see that a very basic relationship has been mentioned over here that is a teacher teaches student and the teachers is a relationship which is enclosing teaches the work of teacher in a diamond shape or a rhombus you can say there are four types of relationship one to one one to many many to many and many to one so we would be going through one by one about all these relationship with their specific examples one to one relationship a one to one relationship is mostly used to split an entity into or provide information concisely and make it more understandable the figure below shows the example of one to one relationship for example female is married to male one female gets married to one male so this is a one to one example relationship one to many relationship in one to many relationship it refers to the relationship between two respective entities that is x and y here we can say student and a course they are both separate entities x and y which an instance of x may be linked to many instances of y in which one instance of the entity x that a student can be related to n number of instances of y but an instance of y is linked to only one instance of x the figure below shows an example of one to many relationship a student can enroll for only one course it is quite an obvious thing such as if you are opting for a course then the course is only one for each student but many student can apply for that same one course so that is a one to many relationship now many to many relationship what does it mean a many to many relationship refers to the relationship between two entities x and y in which x may be linked to many instances of y or vice versa now let us look at the figure below employee m is assigned m project so there can be either many employees working on many projects so this is a relationship of many to many that many employees can be engaged or assigned to a project the figure below shows an example of many to many relationship now you have to note that many to many relationship is split into pair of one to many relationship is a physical entity relationship diagram and this is the diagram being shown as in one to one there is one person related to other person here also a person many persons are related to many kind of projects they have been working on or they have been assigned many to one relationship when more than one instance of the entity is on the left and the only instance of entity on the right associate with the relationship then it is known as many to one relationship we can see the example here student enroll for only one course but a course can have a many student this is quite obvious a course can have many student n number of student a single course can have but a student can only apply for one course only you can see here a student has applied for one course but the course can consist n number of students so this is many to one relationship so in this module we have learned that what is a relationship and what are its type and how can they be denoted by using several examples we will look on to more about database management system in our upcoming videos thank you